Welcome to Savi YouTube channel, Sai Vidya Institute of Technology. In this lecture video, I am going to discuss on some of the standard random variables such as chi-square random variable, student t random variable, Cauchy's random variable and Rary's random variables. Out of these four standard random variables, the first three, they are chi-square, student t and Cauchy's random variable, they are the functions of the normalized Gaussian random variables whereas the Rayleigh's random variables so it is used to locate the position of any point on the free space or the position of any point on a screen or the position of any point on a PCB board. Now let us consider each random variable one by one. Let us consider the first one chi-square random variable. In order to define a chi-square random variable so we need n independent normalized Gaussian random variables z1, z2 up to zr where r is the order of the chi-square random variable then we can define the chi-square random variable capital letter V as capital letter V equal to summation from i equal to 1 to r z i square where r represents the order of the chi-square random variable. Therefore, equation 1 represents the standard equation of the chi-square random variable of any order r. Therefore, the chi-square random variable is, it is a sum of the squares of the normalized Gaussian random variables which are independent in nature. Therefore, it finds application in statistics where n independent realization of the normalized Gaussian random variables are squared and then it is summed. The PDF of the chi-square random variable capital letter V is given by f v of v equal to 1 divided by gamma of r by 2 into 2 to the power of r by 2. The whole thing is multiplied by v to the power of r by 2 minus 1 into exponential of minus v by 2 for any value of v greater than 0. And it is 0 for v less than 0. In this PDF definition, the gamma of r by 2, so this gamma represents the gamma function. <coughs> the typical plots of the PDF curves for the chi-square random variable that is uh, V is uh, plotted in figure number 1 for r equal to 3, r equal to 5 and for r equal to 10. So it is found that as the value of the order increases the intensity or the magnitude of the, the magnitude of the PDF curve reduces whereas the width of the normalized chi-square function increases as the value of the order increases and some of the expectations of chi-square random variable are found to be the first one the mean of the chi-square random variable v it is found to be equal to its order that is the order of the random variable is considered as r therefore the mean also equal to its order small letter r similarly the variance of the variance it is equal to 2 times the r and the characteristic function of chi-square random variable is found to be capital letter pi v of j omega equal to 1 minus 2 into j omega to the power of minus r by 2. Now let us move on to the next standard random variable that is student's t random variable. This random variable it is a combination of normalized Gaussian random variable and uh, chi-square random variable of order r. Now let us consider let z be the normalized Gaussian random variable and v is the chi-square random variable of order r. Then we can define the student's t random variable capital T as t equal to it is z divided by under root of v divided by r where the numerator z represents the normalized Gaussian random variable and the denominator under root of v by r so it is the chi-square random variable of order r. The PDF of student random variable t it is found to be so it is a function of the gamma function it is represented in the equation uh, f t of t. So in this equation that gamma represents the gamma function so it is a function of the gamma function and order of the chi-square random variable r and it is found to be symmetric with respect to y-axis that is with respect to minus infinity that is in between minus infinity to plus infinity it has all possible values and its highest value is found to be at t equal to 0. The typical plots for 
the PDF of the student random variable for various values of its uh, order r equal to 1, r equal to 5 and r equal to infinity is shown in the figure. And from the figures it is found that as the order increases, the magnitude of the student random variable increases and the width also increases. Since the PDF curve is symmetric with respect to y axis, the mean value of the student random variable that is mu t is found to be equal to 0. Whereas the variance is found to be it is r divided by r minus 2 for any value r greater than or equal to 2 and uh, it is not defined for r less than 2. It is also used in some of the statistic applications where uh, we require uh, the ratio of the normalized Gaussian random variable to that of uh, chi-square random variable. So whichever the applications where it requires the ratio of the Gaussian random variable to chi-square random variable then we can make use of this student t random variable. Well, we will move on to the next topic Cauchy's random variable. The Cauchy's random variable, so it is a ratio of two normalized Gaussian random variables. Therefore, in order to define this Cauchy's random variable, we have to consider uh, two zero mean Gaussian random variables x and y. So let us consider these two random variables x and y which are uh, having zero mean. Then we can able to define the Cauchy's random variable w equal to a into x divided by y where a is uh, any value greater than zero. Therefore the Cauchy's random variable it is uh, summarized as it is a ratio of two zero mean Gaussian random variables multiplied by any uh, number a which is greater than 0. The PDF of the Cauchy's random variable is found to be f w of w equal to a divided by pi into omega square plus a square where omega is in between minus infinity to plus infinity and a is greater than 0. And the CDF of the Cauchy's random variable is found to be equal to f w of w equal to 1 by pi into tan inverse of omega by a plus 1 by 2 for all the values of omega in between minus infinity to plus infinity. The plots for CDF and PDF of Cauchy's random variable is shown in figure number 3. The main applications of Cauchy's random variable is in applications where it requires the division of two zero mean Gaussian random variables.